well, I should say that the goal is quite similar. Of course, everybody want to sustain their uh, nation uh, to be able to survive until you know unlimited time. However, the scope of their work that make it different. Country base, which is government, always consider that the nation or its country uh, needs is their priority. While private sector, they probably have limitation, uh, limitation, limit area in their working area in this country, like Indonesia or certain country. But they work globally. So market is something that drives private sector to do something different. That these create differences uh, between government and private sector, how they achieve their goals. Even though they respectively want to achieve or reduce uh, zero deforestation. The private sector has limited authority on helping uh, their uh, business partner. Uh, talking about palm oil of Indonesia, of course, the authority of these companies is limited to their concession area. But of course, in respect to secure their supply, they will cooperate with the smallholders, which is 40% of Indonesia palm oil uh, production. However, this big number of smallholders, I hesitate that companies can accommodate the, that, uh, this 40%. Instead, government may take a bigger role on this. That is why a multi-stakeholder support and engagement is necessary to support uh, smallholders of Indonesia palm oil. It cannot be done only by government or only by private sector, but all together. So this is one of the difficulties of uh, differentiate smallholders. It's a wide, uh, you know, a very wide area of smallholders between two hectares to twenty-five hectares, and this actually uh, uh, show a different attitude of plantation or a, uh, good agriculture practices. Uh, so we have to. Uh, differentiate these smallholders, but who would play the biggest role? I still think companies with their power, you know, bigger company with their power has a very strong role to regulate their suppliers to meet their certain good standard. Because this is the behavior of companies. They will comply. If the market, uh, if the market requires this high standard, they will comply. That's how they meet the, uh, they meet their business. That is why if big, these big companies uh, make good uh, or, or, or high standard on their suppliers, it will also educate them. And at the same time, companies also require to train or to capacitate their suppliers to meet their demand or their tender. I think that is an important uh, collaboration between uh, big companies and smaller ones.